Uju, Kinemagi and Ine Ireland Indigena Cast. And welcome to this week's episode of our U.S. Citizenship Study. Today, we will be looking at questions 16 through 20. <laughs> The purpose of this episode is to help cement civic knowledge for our students based off the questions that make up the U.S. Citizenship Test. We will quiz on these at the end of each week and a link will be posted to Quizlet where students can practice. Question 16, name the two parts of the United States Congress. The answer is the Senate and the House of Representatives. There is an attached link from visitthecapital.gov that you can learn a little bit how these two bodies make up the legislative branch, one of three co-equal branches in the government. And I strongly encourage students to visit any attached links. Next, how many US senators are there? And the answer is 100. The constitution prescribes that the Senate be composed of two senators from each state. Therefore, the Senate currently has 100 members. A senator must be at least 30 years of age and have been a citizen of the United States for nine years. This allows someone to move from Canada or Indonesia, Brazil, Zimbabwe, and after nine years of being a citizen, they could run and serve in the United States Senate. When elected, a US Senator is elected for six years. Article 1, Section 3, where the Senate be divided into three classes. And this way, we don't have 100 new senators every six years, and we keep two-thirds of the body with some experience. Currently, the two Michigan senators are Debbie Stabenow and Gary Peters, both Democrats. Gary Peters was elected most recently in 2020. Finally, the United States House of Representatives has how many members? And that answer is 435. The number each state is allotted is based on the census every 10 years and changes. For instance, Michigan will be losing one House of Representative member going forward, whereas the Senate, it's two per state. I want to thank you for viewing this episode. To practice, please visit this Quizlet and take the opportunity to make sure that you have cemented your learning. Hope everyone has a minogijigad, minwa, mama pee.